Hey guys, it is November 4th, 2017, and I'm gonna take you on an adventure with me today, slash tonight, since it's already six o'clock in the evening, and I have let the day get away from me a little bit. So last weekend, last Saturday night, Brandon and I were supposed to go to a Halloween party hosted by some of Brandon's friends that, I guess at this point, they're just our friends now. Um, but Brandon has known them since high school. And uh, <laughs> that gave me an excuse to not put together a Halloween costume until now, which is, you know, days, literal days after Halloween. Because I'm a professional, trust me. I am about to put a little bit of stuff on my face because I don't want to like fully cake my face on and then have to take it off later to uh, prepare for my Halloween costume, which is if you have seen Stranger Things season two, cool, great, just keep watching. Um, if not, like skip ahead like 10 seconds, please, please do it. I am going to Goodwill and I'm gonna try to find some outfit pieces for Eleven, bitchin' Eleven, from when she's in Chicago and she meets up with Kali. Uh, so that's gonna be my costume and I have to find the blazer and everything. <laughs> I'm going to Goodwill because I'm not paying like full price for this stuff. Like, it's just not happening. Then I'm gonna have to slick back my hair and I think my hair is like a perfect length. Like it only comes to like right here. So in the back, it'll be perfect. But anyway, I, um, I'm gonna take you to Goodwill with me. And I think I already have the pants I'm gonna wear and then I'm just gonna wear the high top Converse's even though that's not what she's wearing. I'm not buying shady shoes from Goodwill. It's just not happening. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace out. Making my way to Goodwill, driving slow, cause I need an oil change, and I'm not getting one until Tuesday. No, 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 no. I'm heading into Goodwill. My god. Uh, I would have recorded more in Goodwill, but like, holy shit. <laughs> Hold on, let me get this in here. I forgot how like little de like depressing and sad Goodwill is. Uh, two of my best friends in uh, high school worked there. They were their first job, so I would go in there pretty frequently and it didn't seem that like depressing. Like, sorry, let me turn the air down. I don't want that to sound wrong, but like, I just felt sad and like it was awkward where I would have recorded more in there um, I only recorded a couple things and oh my god it's Saturday night and people have no idea how to fucking drive and it is insane driving down this road that I live near and oh my god oh my god I swear to god it's that car that just pulled up anyway whatever they almost just hit like four cars uh, anyway, I would have recorded more, but it's just like so quiet and like depressing in there. It's so depressing. Now, I don't know if you've ever been in like a Goodwill or like a thrift store, hand-me-down store. Um, like all of the clothes and all of the stuff there are donations. So it's, it's a lot cheaper. Like I got this suede button-down shirt that looks awesome. It didn't have any stains or anything on it. It was $5. Like you can't beat that. Oh, wait. She gave it to me for like $2. The tax is $4 and she gave it to me for $2. Anyway, better deal than I thought I would get. Regardless, in this particular Goodwill, they had like super low hanging racks. So like there aren't too many employees that work there and they have like a better view of this of the floor. Um, so I wasn't gonna be like, hey guys, like holding my, my phone up to my face. But you know what I mean? I, I got what I had to do in line. Anyway, regardless of all that, success! Oh my God. I completely forgot I was supposed to get Brandon something and I didn't and shit. Shice. Poops. Well anyway, I'm gonna go back home and I'll see you when I get home. I'll talk to you more and like debut my whole outfit when I get home. Thanks. Alright, what's up? I just got back from Goodwill and like 
these blacks totally don't match. I'm gonna change this undershirt, but like, I think I did pretty good. I have to find some gloves to rip up, but like, I have this, the sock action going on. Do you see that? And like, I think it's coming together pretty well. Like, look, just imagine like my hair, hold on, just imagine my hair like, slick back kind of like this. And with, of course, like, the darker makeup, I'm gonna do that in a second, but, like, I think that's legit. I just have to change this into something else. So I'm looking for hair gel, and I can't find any right now. Ooh, look at that blue. So I'm just gonna, like, have to find something, or I don't know, make something up. I have no idea what I'm gonna do. I just need to make sure that these two parts don't fall down like this. They need to, like, go back and stay back and I have no idea why. I think this is like a blessing in disguise, but I just opened our hall closet and our bottle of blood, like not even kidding, this is like six or seven years old. It's still in the hall closet <sighs> for my signature 11 nosebleed. And no, I'm not doing the double nosebleed from the final, not final scene, but you know, like the fight, final fight scene, I'm not, I'm not doing the double nosebleed, just the single nosebleed. Cause you know, my nose bleeds all the time anyway, so. All right, update. I can't find hair gel to save my life. So I have a bunch of bobby pins here and I'm just gonna try to pin back my hair and then use a lot of hairspray. Just like a lot of super hold hairspray to keep it back, you know what I'm saying? All right, I'm gonna set you up so you can watch. I think hair, hair is good to go, I think. I don't think it's gonna get much better than this, so. Now I am a little bit closer to the 11, just cause I've got this, I know I packed it in. It's a lot uh, more saturated than the 11's look, but I'm gonna finish up the rest of my makeup and then we will be finding some gloves and also be finding some Costumes for Brandon. Oh, Alright, I have made some developments on my face, like giving myself some color here and there. And I think I'm gonna try to wear my contacts, which is terrifying. And can I find any contacts to wear? Let's find out. Update Jackpot. Okay. Um I just put my contacts in without any problems and they don't burn. Also, what? Who am I? Where have I been? Um, do you like me without contacts? Okay, this is not my normal makeup. I mean, you can see like these indents. I have to fix everything, but... Who is she? What's her story? I'm not there yet. Alright, I feel like this is like... As good as it's gonna get. I need to do the blood and need to find some gloves so i'm gonna do that oh my god i really thought i was recording that whole time i just did the blood how does the blood look it like went down really far i tried to stop it before it got too far i don't think it like helped at all anyway i think it looks pretty good but this red like look at my hand it stains so easily so i'm gonna be looking like this tomorrow for sure all right guys, so I'm all finished. I found, I found out, I looked at another reference picture. Um, oh my God, I just went to move my glasses up on my nose. <laughs> she has a cuff covering her numbers on her arm. So I just did that. No gloves or anything, sorry, misinformed. Um, but this is the final look. I think my hair is slicked back pretty nicely and this blazer doesn't do too bad of a job. I did have to uh, safety pin it back a little bit. Ooh, do I have two safety pins here? No, it's fine. Um, so I have this and then I have my 
light jeans, my very light jeans, and then my collar like that. That honestly does not look bad at all. It looks awesome. I'm so excited. Ugh. And I just got a quick outfit together for Brandon, and it is um, just a quick lumberjack. So like flannel and jeans. Super easy. <coughs> and he hasn't shaved in who knows when, so it's perfect. But thanks for joining next time.